Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who haven't been to my channel before, just a bit of background. My name is Rosie and I am a third and final year student studying archaeology and anthropology at St Peter's College at the University of Oxford. And basically this video is just going to be me taking you through what I do in a day, my classes, my lectures. <laughs> Right now it is 8.15am and I don't have a class until 12. I would have a lecture at 10 till 11 but I've got to finish an essay before the deadline which is 2pm and I have other back-to-back -back classes from 12 till 5. So I'm gonna have to just sacrifice that one in the morning and I hope someone else has notes they can send me. I just made coffee in my herb of bon mug and it is such a good mug, it's actually really dirty. Uh, I've spilled coffee all over it. But yeah, I've used uh, Alperica shoe milk. Currently that's my breakfast, obviously I'm going to eat more than this, but I haven't really got any breakfast food at the moment. Great. I have 580 words of my essay so far, so I need to do about 1500 more this morning and I've got three and a half hours yeah until my class so I think that's pretty doable it is now 9.37 so I've still got a good two hours and like 10 minutes before I need to set off for my class and I'm currently on 1216 words so I've written like 700 more words in an hour. I'm gonna go eat now, I've just realised I've actually got Weetabix so I'm gonna go eat Weetabix yeah. and then I will crack on and finish it and hopefully have it done Maybe even by 11, which would give me some time to organise my life before I go to my classes, which would be brilliant. Before I go and have my breakfast, I'll just explain what I've actually got to do today. So, this here is the essay that I'm finishing. It is due today at 2pm. My targets for today are to finish the essay, to go to my practical lecture and my dissertation meeting which takes me till about 5pm then somewhere in between I have an hour for lunch so hopefully I'll be able to email the doctors, plan two videos and then if I have time I'll read one dissertation article they're ambitious but yeah that's what I've got to do It's my beautiful bowl of wheat mix obviously I'm gonna add some cashew milk to it um, because I'm not a maniac. I did go through a phase once in the first year where I would eat just dry Weetabix with tahini because I really couldn't be bothered going out to buy bread. So I've got three Weetabix from Aldi, they're not real Weetabix, goji berries, chia seeds and some peanut butter. I don't know why I put goji berries and chia seeds uh, on my Weetabix. This better tastes good. This is literally the most jumped up Weetabix I think I've ever seen someone make ever. Also, I really like to like fully drown it in milk. Don't hate. So this is my question that I'm actually writing. And I just wrote a paragraph and I really don't know like if it makes any sel sel sense. Any sense? You you could you do you wait. I haven't quite finished yet, but I've got one thousand six hundred words, and also know what I'm writing for the rest of this paragraph. Like all I've got to do is finish this paragraph and a conclusion. So it's gonna take me like maximum twenty minutes, which I can do in my lunch break and still get my essay in on time, and go to all my classes. So yeah, that's. Perfect, really. As it is half past 11, I need to get ready to go. I need to get dressed into like actual clothes and not just sweatpants and make my bed and 
brush my teeth, etc. Right, this is what I am wearing today. Before I let past Rosie carry on, can we just appreciate, like, how put together I look in this? I actually have quite a nice outfit on. Who am I? Who is she? Where did you find her? I was wearing a jumper, but I realised it's actually 15 degrees outside, which is roasting compared to the temperatures we have had over the last few days, so hopefully I don't freeze to death. I'm going to go now, so... Uh, whoa. Ah! Okay, I need to leave. past Peter's scares me because it's like so little but it's a great shortcut and also really pretty like, it's such a nice little walk and there's no one here so I'll vlog it I started cooking the soup and now I realised it's got milk in great Perfect. Excellent. Hello, darkness, my old friend. My essay is finished and I got it in like five minutes before the deadline, which is absolutely fine. I've now got a class like right now, which I need to go to on bones and the skeleton and that should be really fun i'm really excited i am however very hungry because as you saw my soup has milk in it and i'm allergic to that my class is now two hours and i have a dissertation meeting so this wheat bix better sustain me And I'm just gonna go back to my room now and do my dissertation. Exciting slash terrifying. It's 5.15pm now and I still haven't eaten because, as you saw before, I got the wrong soup and I haven't been back until now but I went shopping and I bought some cheese and salad as you saw and yeah I've just made three sandwiches I'm so excited to eat them. Resisted the urge to get like four pizzas off Deliveroo. Um, this is a lot cheaper. I couldn't wait any longer to eat so I've decided to do like a little mukbang type thing while I tell you about my dissertation meeting and where I'm at with all of that stress. Uh, so I had a dissertation meeting today. Okay, the meeting was great. I need to not talk with my mouth full. Maybe this is a bad idea. How do people do this? My meeting went well. It was really helpful. My supervisor's great. Um, He's, he's gonna like get me resources and stuff that he can think of but I'm just having a stress at the moment about my dissertation because all of the research that you've seen that I've done and the videos that I've made so far are
all of the research that I've done over the summer and like all of the stuff I've talked about in previous videos is kind of void. Like obviously the, the stuff that I've learned about physical anthropology isn't void because I'm gonna still be applying that but I have essentially been told to change my whole topic so my topic was apparently too broad and I tried, I really tried to zoom it in further to like a specific site or a specific country and really struggled because there was so little research on that area and other people had done work on areas that were a bit more vast. I'd lost my drive and my direction because I had no idea where I was taking it and nothing was giving me the outcome that I wanted. Despite having so much research, I, like I thought I had done summer so well and I had got so far ahead and now I just feel like I'm way behind again because I don't even have a question and yes, okay, I have a topic now and I can work a question out of that but... For reference, we're meant to, over Christmas, be writing a first draft. And I only just got my subject today and it is November. Like I said, my supervisor was really helpful and I have now got an area that I'm working with and he's he's been really great about it. But I still can't help being slightly terrified and feeling like I've been left behind almost. Because I should have had these meetings to tell me that what I'd chosen was wrong before summer and no one answered my emails and helped me like arrange stuff properly. Okay, that was possibly the world's most unsuccessful mukbang over. Um, yep, I'm done. I'm gonna watch Netflix for half an hour because my brain hurts. Then I've got a little 21st gathering, which is only gonna be an hour or two. And so at like eight, half eight, I'm gonna carry on with my dissertation and try and basically get, pull myself together about it. Okay, excellent. It's now 7.30 and we've just done like little birthday tea that we were gonna have. Um, it's not finished yet, we know like party games and stuff, it's gonna be so fun, like musical statues and I'm so excited. But I'm not gonna film that because some people are drinking and then they don't want to be on YouTube etc etc. Um, so I'm just gonna end the video here because if I do end up doing work afterwards it's just gonna be a montage and it's not gonna be entertaining and I hopefully will end up doing work afterwards but I should do and I think I will um, my dissertation not just any work uh, but yeah I'm gonna sign off the video now so thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye!